What's going on guys? Today's episode is going to be a very special update and will feature this little lady here who I've named Hayley Williams. That's what you get. Now she's my redback spider and she has the deadliest web in my entire collection. Now redbacks are masters of web design. Nothing can escape their webs and I reckon they've probably got the stickiest, glueiest silk of any spider in Australia. It's like an instant super glue and it's so deadly. And, and this kind of silk is one of the strongest known materials that there is. And uh, the scientific name is Latrodectus hasselti and they're related to the Black Widow. And because they are part of that family, you know, when it comes to reproducing, we all know what happens there. <laughs> Redbacks like this are very common in Australia, but they, they mostly live in really hot areas like in Queensland where I live. They're usually found near houses, but generally around objects that, um, that haven't been disturbed in a while. So, you know, you tend to come across them like in the garage or under the house or even in a pile of wood that's been left outside for a while. They like it to be really dry and rigid and, and away from the wind and the weather. And what you'll find is they, they hang upside down on the top of their web under a surface or a ceiling. And the way that they construct their home is like an out of control mess with strands of web stretching from, from the ceiling to the floor in pretty much every direction. And there's always an anchor point at the bottom and a trip wire at the top. And any sort of insect that comes along and gets caught in the redback's web is a goner. And with the slightest touch of the web, it will trigger a trip line and then they're stuck. And, it, and it's, it's pretty much impossible to break free. And as they're struggling and wriggling around, the redback's spidey senses kick in right and they know exactly where their prey is. And, and just like the flash, they come right down from their spot, but they don't bite just yet. They'll, they'll turn around and back it in close to their prey so they can wrap it up tight. And then out of their fourth legs, like their back legs, they throw the web from their spinnerets, but like very accurately, like, like as fast as they can until it's all wrapped up. But they do this all at a safe distance. They, they won't get too close to their prey until they can sense by the tiny movements that it is completely trapped and, and you know, ain't going nowhere. Then they usually just bite right on the end of a leg or a tail. And man, that redback venom is deadly as. Like only a tiny drop is needed and most of the time the insect will be killed almost instantly and then the redback will just wait there you know um, they they really are one of the best spiders we've got here so um, I'm just gonna chuck in a cricket so we can see Haley in action Okay guys, that's it for me. I'm just gonna leave you with some sick footage of my redback spider. Thanks for watching guys. Yeah,